This project offers a different challenge for what we are used to, which is very interesting and tests our knowledge to the limit. Without interdisciplinary work, no astronaut would ever fly to Mars. To understand what makes Inspired so special, maybe you should know something about the history. So in the very beginning it was the idea to teach students in the very first beginning of their study programs what all this is about. So why do they have to learn all those uh, basic techniques and technologies and um, so we intended to have a, a project which tells them this is something you can or something useful you can do with that. And that should be uh, accomplished in a team and therefore we give them a week or so to develop their own project, to present it and to see this might be something I can do in my job in the, in the future. And that has been, that evolved over the time. So we were then uh, including interdisciplinary approaches. We're not just one discipline but several disciplines were working together. And that also required some uh, advancement in the topics we gave the students. So that should address every single discipline at the same level. So and you could only get a meaningful result if everybody contributes. And in the next stage, we even get further in including an interdisciplinary approach. Students from abroad with a different cultural and um, uh, yeah, maybe also educational background, so therefore we also broaden the scope of our students. And this is, in my opinion, what it makes so special. So our first year of Inspired within the UNITE network was, as I said, a very special year, the virtual team project, but nevertheless, so what we expect from being partner of UNITE is that we will kind of uh, evolve the project further. So as I said, it started from the very early days on with a simple format and now it's a very complex science and educational driven teamwork and that's something we will see in the future, ideally taken up by other UNITE partners and then being adapted to their, to their um, educational settings. And this is something which I'm really interested in and I would like to see how Inspired or the virtual team projects uh, managed to do uh, their kickstart in Lisbon, for example, next year. And hopefully, very, very hopefully, we will be able to go back to a, a presence format where the teams can really meet each other, which is also a very important factor of this uh, teamwork we do here. We felt well prepared until March 2020 when the corona pandemic changed everything. So we found ourselves in front of the question if there should be a virtual team project. And we were not at all sure at this moment if this was a good idea. So our experiences so far are that the students have no problems at all with the digital setting, but that in contrast, uh, guidance from mentors and scientific advisors is absolutely needed for methodical and scientific work. Um, the teams develop a strong team spirit and commitment uh, for the team and even want to stay in contact after the project and that's a wonderful result. For the INSPIRED project the goal was to develop a bioreactor that would uh, be able to sustain a crew of six astronauts for at least two years in Mars and it was a challenge, let me tell you. <laughs> it's okay if you are a bit shy or uh, you are not as confident with your English as you would like because everyone is on the same boat. Uh, we just work as a team, we figure out how to make it work and uh, we build uh, friendships and uh, great working groups and it's uh, very satisfying at the end how you evolve as a person. I'm a bit sad that UNITE only came along in these uh, past few months. I'm now finishing my master's degree and almost finishing my studying uh, journey. But you that are starting or in the middle of your process, uh, just go for it. It's an amazing experience and you will never regret it. I would do it again with my eyes closed. I applied for INSPIRED because I would like to do my Master of Science in Radiation Biology and I'm pretty interested in everything which is about space. I would definitely recommend INSPIRED to other students because you learn so much about the interdisciplinary work and that different fields of studies are important to get diverse solutions and approaches for a problem. And in the end you can choose the most doable and the most stable one.
Without interdisciplinary work, no astronaut would ever fly to Mars. I definitely recommend you apply for it. Doing this project, you will open your minds, understand new perspectives, new subjects, broaden your career possibilities and meet amazing people from other countries. When you will finish this project, you will notice that we involved a lot in terms of knowledge and personal development. With this project, you will really get inspired to the future. This project offers a different challenge for what we are used to, which is very interesting and tests our knowledge to the limit. It allows us to gain and improve our skills in such different topics, such as material science, biology, product development, project management, and much more. It also offers a unique opportunity to know more people learn about different culture, countries, societies and lifestyles by exchanging different perspectives, ideas and knowledge. Uh, so all of these differences and similarities were essential and it helped us to do a great creative and innovative project. I was very impressed. Uh, I think the, the combination of uh, a real challenge and a challenge that was very open to which there was no single correct solution and where the number of degrees of freedom was extremely high, provided the students with an opportunity to really experience multidisciplinary engineering in a way that they never do in their education otherwise. It was interesting to see how professional the teams were. Uh, I was really impressed by all the presentations and I think it's uh, definitely an initiative that we should see more of. It's a really clear example of how you can collaborate between universities, in this case even virtually, drawing on the strengths of the different universities to offer something that no student could probably experience in their own home institution alone. And I think that that's really what UNITE stands for. UNITE is about leveraging the special capabilities of each of the partner universities to really offer something well beyond what is possible in the context of a single university, even if we have very broad, powerful technical universities in the consortium. Of course, we plan to keep all the key aspects of the INSPIRE projects, and we are planning to define a real life challenge that must be multidisciplinary and also impossible to solve by only one area of, of knowledge. Our version of the INSPIRE project happens because we share uh, the same uh, space in terms of uh, exchanging ideas and uh, sharing and dissemination of, of good practices, which is one of the main goals of, of UNITE. So if you look at the lessons learned, as I said, so we could tell it's possible to do it in a completely virtual format without any team meetings and presence, which is not ideal, but at least feasible. And this is something very special. And that is due to the fact that everybody gave his best. So especially those doing the training. So all the educational advice uh, given by the team, very much thank you to that for that. And also to the students who uh, yeah, volunteered in starting in a virtual project and uh, therefore I think I need to thank and I want to thank everybody uh, by heart for doing that very special project. Thank you. Thank you for your time and I hope you feel inspired.